So one thing people have asked me about is a way to auto shout out people whenever you get raided. And that's something that can help us out a whole lot, especially smaller streamers that don't have mods that are always there to just constantly, you know, give appreciation and auto shout out people. So that's helpful. If you're not already familiar, I do have another video that goes into more detail a little bit more involved setting up a secondary local bot that will actually let you preset regulars that you want to be automatically shouted out whenever they come into your stream and say something that uses the local streamlabs chat bot i'll link that below but this is a cover you know the random people that you may not know that you're not prepared for that you're meeting for the first time upon a raid so what we're going to use for this is the stream elements cloud chat bot which is a pretty popular one most people probably already use that if you don't it's really simple to set up so we'll, let's go ahead and get started so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to log into our stream elements dashboard again if you haven't used stream elements before you just go to streamelements.com, log in with your Twitch account, and this will be one of the first things you see after a little introduction. Now, if you don't currently have this bot in your chat channel, you'll have a button here that says join channel. So you will need to do that first, but a lot of us probably already have this bot. So the next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go down here to the bot section on the left and go to modules. It's really straightforward, pretty simple. If chat alerts is not already enabled, you'll turn that on. So here's where you set up all your individual sections. And if you want, you can disable or enable or customize individual types of chat alerts that you want here. The one we're concerned with for this video is raids. So in the raid section, all we're gonna do is we're gonna edit it. And you can do your own version of this. This one's pretty lengthy. I'll try to um, put that in the description below for a sample. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna make sure you use this user variable right here. And that's gonna put the name of whoever's rating you into wherever you put that. Amount is a variable for how many viewers. So for example, this one, when someone raids us, it has kind of the typical raid response says, hey, user just rated the channel with this amount of viewers. And then to do different emotes and stuff, I did like the bleed purple, which is one bleed purple is a Twitch global one. So you shouldn't have any issues with your bot using that one for an example. So then I continue here, like check them out at the twitch.tv forward slash, you know, that URL. And then what you want to do here is the dollar sign for the variable and then the brackets and user dot name, and that'll populate it with their actual Twitch username. And then you can even add where they were last seen playing and then the variable there for gaming user. So again, I'm gonna go ahead and include this in the description below to um, give you a good starting place. Feel free to shuffle these variables and wordings and everything around and it'll work. It's pretty straightforward. There's not a lot to it. It's a, it's a fairly simple way to add some more simplicity and pretty good features to your existing stream. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comments below. We also have a new Gilded server. So you can hop in to gilded.gg forward slash classic Caleb TV. You can also go to classic Caleb.pro and that has all kinds of stuff, all my information, stream schedules, different socials, anything you need there. So again, I hope this helps.